if the Earth literally cracked open. Everybody go! Oh my God. When you're making San Andreas and creating a 9.6 earthquake, it requires a great team of people around you. Not only what would that look like, but then how do we make it truly immersive? This is not over. San Andreas is about the largest earthquake ever recorded, hitting California, and the aftermath of that. People are thrust into these remarkable situations together. What are we gonna do? We're gonna get our daughter. It's inspiring and powerful, and these guys will stop at nothing to do the right thing. They basically get everything thrown at them, from the earthquake to tsunamis, to collapsing buildings, to planes crashing, boats crashing. Everyone take cover! Pretty much everything that a person could possibly experience in one very bad day. Action! This was a hard, daunting shoot because everything had to be as real as possible. Dwayne wanted to jump out of that helicopter. They knew they were gonna be underwater for a week. That was in the script. God didn't bamboozle them. They knew what they were signing up for. The director has wanted to do a lot of it in camera, but it helps the actors a lot. Everything's shaking and the lights are swinging and so it puts you right there. It truly immerses the audience. There's a fabric to what they're watching that just feels real. My first day on set, I saw a girl hanging in a car on a cliff that had made on the back lot with the biggest fan you've ever seen in your life blowing dust. It was so crazy. I was rappelling out of the helo all the way down, one shot down the side of a mountain. Dwayne rappelled 150 feet out of a helicopter. There's no faking that. That's Dwayne doing that. Natalie, we are going now! <laughs> I got you! What do we say we get you home now? What's that noise? Get down! Get down! One of the biggest challenges was we have a building that gets hit by a tsunami and then sinks slowly. Coming up with a way to get a 9,000 square foot office floor to sink was very complex. We were in the largest tank in Australia, one of the largest tanks in the world. Over two million gallons of water in this thing. It was the largest structure built within a tank. Five-story building that had to flood in an instant. They drop all this water in on you and the force of the water pushes you back. The floor of the tank itself can actually drop and go side to side. So you're not actually filling water, they're dropping the floor, which is kind of amazing. Everything is built, everything's interactive. I've never seen anything like it. Hundreds of members of crews, underwater cameras, it's bananas. <laughs> There's just so many things that are coming at you. You're on this thrilling ride on the edge of your seat. Come on! And yet you're also emotionally really engaged. I love you, Dad. There's action, there's humanity. There's heroes, and it is spectacular.